going to show you how you can make your very own wooden ring. So once you're through, just you'll need to clean up the edges. Just check your finger fits in it. There you go. My finger fits in it. So here's the basic ring shape cut. It's not pretty, but it will end up looking nice. I'm going to saw it down the middle so I don't get two smaller rings. Okay, so I now have two rings, so I'm going to sand these up again on the drum. As I said, they do have a tendency to break and crumble. Look. Like that. So, I've only got one to work with now. Just had another one break, so... What I'm going to do is try using a bit of a harder wood, because look, if I give this a gentle squeeze, well, I say gentle, it just crumbles. So, I think we're going to make this out of something a little stronger. found these two pieces of, I'm not sure what this wood is, maybe like some exotic wood, so I'm going to use that. Okay, so here's the ring. So what we need to do now is give it a clean up on the inside and just make it look a bit better because here it's really narrow and then here it's quite wide so I just need to fix that. So the ring in my opinion is now almost done. Oh, just notice it. I didn't wear a dust mask for that tiny bit just because it was so small, but I should really. Okay, if we can get the camera to focus, there we go. It's nice and thin. I don't like this little bit of tear out here, but I mean, I could just need to nut up a second. Okay, so as you can see, it's a nice little ring. It looks rather nice. All that remains for me to do is, oh, sorry, out of focus, is a couple of coats of Danish oil. Now, you should really use a lint-free cloth for, for this, but I don't have one to hand, so I'm going to use a little rag and just wipe the oil over. Doesn't that look lovely? Remember to do the inside if you want to. Right. So now, just leave that to hang. So whilst that's drying, it actually needs six hours to dry. Um, I'm gonna do the next ring. Same principle as last one. Now with the ring finished for the second time, this is the second one. Um, I quite like this one. I just need to give this a coat of Danish oil and hang it up too. So there you go, nice coat of Danish oil on that.